Good morning, this is Dr. Lou Jacobs and I have a thought for you. There's an interesting quote that I'd like you to consider and it goes like this. You can't heal in the same environment that created your problems in the first place. You can't heal in the same environment that created your problems in the first place. Now you can if you alter that environment but not if it remains the same. So how do you alter the environment that created the problems so that you can get better? Well, you can alter it by eliminating the environment. Unfortunately for most of us, there's two primary environments that we have to live with, work and home. And neither one of those is easy to eliminate. So what are you left with? You're left with altering the environment. So how do you alter the environment? Well, I look at it like this. Take a look at the environment that you're living in, that you're working in, that you're playing in, and think of it as the side of a scale. The environment and the bad stuff in the environment, the stress of various types, is on one side, and the good stuff is on the opposite side. Now, altering, getting out of that environment would add a lot of good, potentially, you went to another environment, but we said that that's not usually possible. So you have to add good things to the good side to overpower the bad side if you want to get better. And you have to do it in such a way that your body is getting enough positive feedback that it overrides all the bad that not only you're feeling right now or, or experiencing right now, but also that which led up to feeling bad. Because you see, if you don't deal with the underlying problem, it's going to come back and probably with a vengeance. If rather than drilling out a cavity and filling the hole, you just filled the hole over the cavity, it's going to come back. If rather than taking the rust off of your car and then rebuilding the body, you just paint it over the rust, it doesn't work. It just keeps going, and next time you start to feel it or to see it, it's worse than it was before. So when you're thinking about your symptoms and how you want to get rid of them, think about whether or not you can change your environment to one that is healing, and think about how much realistically you're likely going to need to get out of this rut, to clear out the rust, to drill out the cavity so that the problem doesn't come back. Back pain and spinal issues are very complicated because there's so many moving parts, right? So the more complicated an environment, the trickier it's going to be to change it. You need to really get help on this so that you have reasonable expectations, so that you know what you're going to need to do in order to manage it without the use of heavy drugs and surgery. It's as simple as that. You can't heal in the same environment that caused the problem. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. I appreciate you. I appreciate the time that it took for you to watch this. I hope it was helpful. Take care.